Hey guys, welcome back to Surviving Mars. We are the lone Martian colony out there. I think we are anyway. I've not I've not seen any else around here, and we've not seen any other any other landing sites on Mars. So I assume that we are the sole surviving colony on Mars. Well, you can see we have a few issues, and the one issue that I want to bring immediately to uh, attention is the fact that we say we've got a power shortage here. But now that I hover over it, you can see we've got a whole bunch of stored power here. So let's go and try and find our acute accumulators they should be about somewhere the, these bad boys right here let's have a look they all seem like very close to being totally full we've got a discharge of minus two and everything seems to be working out fairly well here so i'm not that bothered about this storage space is full here and this thing needs to get destroyed uh, we also have a bit of a problem i'm not worried about that uh, a bit of a problem with our um our population here. You can see that this place is nearly empty, which means that we're not getting enough workers working in the places that we need to go. Now, I literally just want a bunch of people. No, that's that's technology. Why would you do that? If we come down to the rocket, we go passenger rocket. Uh, we're just going to like restrict the group down until we have something like a group of twelve. Uh, so let's go to the specialization. I don't care about whether they're specialized or not. Um, I've got a lot of no's going on here. I don't, I don't actually care. Let's just take all of those off. Is there anything here we particularly don't want? No. No, I don't. That, that, that's all good. We've got 35 out of 77. Let's review and see what we got. Who are we... I'm just going to click. We're missing a guru for a specific reason. I'm not sure what. I bet it's something to do with the flaws we have restricted here. Let's see. Gambling, that's fine. And lazy is restricted. That's fine. What about the perks? We've restricted the gamers here because we don't have the electronic parts to bring them in I want to be like yes please we want sexy people um, and is there anything else in particular that I really want to make sure we've got no let's review the, uh, the the settings here then we want a geologist a botanist an officer it's sexy we'll take the set well, no I'm not I'm not worried I'm not worried a guru will definitely take we're getting a bunch of geologists here this is quite good though honestly I could have done with people with no specializations and medics because they are the guys that work the other areas particularly also engineers not that i see any engineers on the go at the moment i think we might be out the engineers of course are the people that work inside the uh, factories and stuff so that would be pretty good uh, there's an engineer there and an engineer there we'll, we'll take them we've got an alcoholic and a party animal that that's pretty good we'll, we'll take those one more needed let's see where the highest ranking non-specialist is uh, and we'll probably take them of course the highest ranking non-specialist that we have already not taken okay and that's a 12 let's launch that up we're gonna bring them here I would also like to bring a whole bunch of other people to this uh, this dome over here because this is where we start getting some other stuff maybe we can get some more metals on the go uh, let's go and have a look over here I've got a yeah of course we are totally out of metals on this side and this is why we needed to make sure that this was a production that got going as fast as possible so let's pop that down there let's also think about where we're going to put a little bit of a power outlay now you can see we've got all this coming in here but I think we'll be fine if I just pop that like that and connect it I can't I can't see the bit that I want to do but I think it's there let's turn around and have a look yeah that's that's the one i wanted to connect to great so we get the metal sorted out and we've got some more people are coming in now last time we uh we, we got a very important bit of technology research that i kind of just let slip under the radar we, we didn't really discuss it much but it is one of the more important pieces that we've got if we have a look here co2 jet propulsion build the shuttle hub now you might be asking why do i want a shuttle hub well these domes are kind of working as their own little independent areas at the moment they're not really sharing stuff back and forth but the shuttle hub is the way to make them do said sharing maybe we'll put this one here we get a cable connection on the go i did kind of want to put it somewhere a little bit more central if at all possible maybe up there maybe over here the reason i want to put it more central is of course that i want it to uh, to to look after more than just one building but maybe we'll end up putting a couple if we put this one down right here now it's going to take forever to make because you can see it needs 10 electronics and 10 uh, 15 polymers the concrete we should have in uh, rough and ready supply let's do another thing whilst i'm looking at it you can see that we've got this line coming in here but there's also all this um, concrete here and I'd like to get this completely cleared out if at all possible it's going to take a little bit of time but I think we'll be fine with that 
You know what I'm not fine with? The fact that there's not enough room to squeeze this bad boy in here. Like, that's good, and that would be the best place. But it turns out that we've got this waste rock uh, facility right here. So what happens if I just, like, delete that? Which is a bad idea. We, we all know it's a bad idea, and the reason that it's a bad idea is the fact that... Bam, bam, uh, come on. Is the fact that we need to actually deal with that at some point. That that does, that does not feel great to me. We, need, we want to put it one further back from there if we can. Uh, swing it around that way. Actually, to get the con the coverage I want. Look, you see these ones down here. We're going to have to go deeper. We're going to have to get in closer. Uh, we'll do that that way, and then we'll have another one coming this way and another one coming this way. And maybe eventually we'll actually work out a way of storing all this. Speaking of storage, of uh, clearing all this, sorry. Now I'm going to speak of storage. I need somewhere to put all my waste rock. You can see we've been slowly building up waste rock over here but that's just not enough just not enough uh, we need somewhere to put some other places down because this this is the overflowing and this concrete over here is overflowing I'm feeling maybe somewhere somewhere in amongst this lot but there's, there's got to be an area where we don't really use anymore uh there's not really i'm looking around <laughs> almost everything that i use uh, almost everywhere that i can see is a place that i want to use for something or other but we'll just throw in a whole bunch of these like this and see if this works out well for us i think that's a good place there 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 and there okay that that's a lot of storage area for waste rock there okay the next thing i want to do is go around and have a look at what domes we've got here so you can see that this place is not uh, not lined up for dealing with children if we come over here we've got like a school and nurseries and this is the area that really can deal with children so if i come into this filtering um system here i suppose we go big old thumbs up and apply there uh we're gonna go next dome which is not the one i want to see but the dome afterwards the one here uh this has got a child in it get, get out of here i don't i don't want children being in this place uh also now that if we come out of all of this lot now that this place doesn't actually have oh it does have a need for geologists anymore okay well this place doesn't have a need for geologists so let's try and make sure that there are no geologists here specialization geologists uh, please please be gone we do not need you here. Let's apply that, and hopefully they will walk away and go to a different dome. Now, the reason that we I waited until now to do this is, of course, the shuttle hubs. Are we getting anywhere close to getting this done? Actually actually just waiting on polymer which is a pretty standard state of affairs but the fact that we are making enough makes me feel pretty good there we've even got spare electronics on the go oh, okay cool this 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 is actually very good very very good unfortunately all my drones are currently in the process of moving rock about so that's that's not the best turns out i'm not allowed to uh, go for the middle one either if i press plus it goes up Research to the, the times five uh, we've got soil adaptation which if i remember correctly let's go and have a look uh, gave us farms which uh really is an amazing thing it's a blessing if i'm to be honest uh let's try and figure out where we can put a farm i'm not sure if we've got anywhere particularly sorted for it now this is obviously geologist haven uh and back over here we've got polymers being made is there anything else being made over here we don't really have the room here we don't really have the room if i'm to be totally honest and we don't really have the room over here so it kind of just leaves this place to be where we make our food i'm okay with that as long as you guys are we are getting massive no drone problems here i thought we had you you've got no power well first off you should be the most important thing on the system now let's have a look here what's going on here we're only making 38 out of 44 i'm sure we can do a thing about that um can we connect these they look like they want to be connected let's connect these up and then hopefully the the uh the surplus that we have over this side can i actually make this work please thanks the surplus that we have over this side should make up for it because you can see we're we're in surplus of about 50 so that that should work out pretty good as long as this all gets done look, look, look shuttles are off they're going around they're doing their thing oh man that is so good is it actually moving people right now payload nothing but i'm fairly sure i just watched you shift some people around i don't know what what are you picking up and moving there it could be 
anything. So we've done the waste stores, we've done the shuttles, we've filtered the domes. The next thing I wanted to really get on with was looking down here to see if I can actually get some of these water systems on the go. Uh, I've got that written down on my list, but if I actually come and have a look back up here, I'm not Cable that bothered about completely. either oxygen or water. I seem to be producing double water and, wow, uh, literally six times the amount of oxygen I need. So uh, we're, we're just going to sit on this for a little bit and I will see you guys in a second when we felt all the... Uh, Oh, actually, no, we're not. We're going to find out what this uh, building sitting on no uh, uh, resource would do. So let's get rid of that. That will allow us to start shunting up this way a little bit. This has no power on the go. That is a fine man. I really thought that was going to be taking a little bit of a cut there, but it turns out not. I would like to do a few more cuts than I have been doing in the past few episodes, because whilst I can just sit here and talk to you for 20 minutes about everything that I see in front of me, uh, what is this, people? Uh, there, there's... Uh, I, I'm not getting so advanced in the game like that. So, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in a second. So we've had the colonists arrive. You can see all the people, all the people, all the drones moving food and fuel around. If we come over here, we've got a lot of food to offload, but we've got a load of, sorry, food to offload, fuel to onload. But this should have hopefully filled up these living quarters over here. Pretty close, pretty close, if I'm to be honest. Uh, and with that, we should have full shifts clicking over in almost all these places. That That is good. That is good. I am super happy about what is going on here. Let's take a moment to have a look at the overview overview of the dome though and see why people are being upset we've got people wanting to drink do we have a space bar anywhere this is a thing do we have the space bar uh, maybe we should make this the space bar let's maybe get rid of this uh, nursery here replace it with something a little bit better have a space bar here i'm not sure what would be better to put in there but i'm gonna go with it we're gonna uh, there's no food delivery system over here how dare i okay so we definitely need to get rid of this nursery here uh, as i was saying we're gonna go for this is where the space bar is going to be. This is where the space bar is going to be. We're going to pop that in there. We're going to use said fil dome filtering. We've talked about this before so that I can come into the floors and go, alcoholics, all come here. Every single alcoholic should come and live over this way. That should make uh, things work out a little bit better for us. I'm not sure if we need to put a shuttle hub all the way down there. I'm not sure what these guys are actually capable of doing, what the range is. If anybody actually knows, do let me know. But for now, I'm just going to put this over here in this little snug area. And hopefully we'll be able to get a few more things made. This power, uh, it's not storing as much as I would like. What's going Sector on over here? So this must just be where I connected it up. And almost immediately, look at this. We are ready to take off again. It's just the fuel. Uh, food, sorry. Just the food needs to uh, stack up somewhere. Oh, guys. Okay. So mission evaluation has happened. New door. The mission evaluation period is over and the results of our efforts are visible. More importantly, down here, you have researched 36 out of 40. But uh, the objective complete? 36 out of 40? Really? Is that is that complete, is it? I thought that would be a failure, but it turns out, no, it's good enough. So uh, we'll, we'll take that. Still more food to be taken out of there. Uh, storage compressions working on. Utility cop crops are also working on. At some point, I'd like to get the Martian universe down, but I'm not sure if I'm uh, that bothered by it. I'm just having a look around. Bioengineering farms increase the comforts of all residents. Ooh, we'll stick that one on there as I'm about to start putting farms into places. And there's the electronics factory getting ready to get built there. In-dome buildings require maintenance less often. Let's put that. In fact, I'm going to swap those two around there and that should work out pretty well. Shuttle speed increased by 33%. Whatever, we've got, we've got ourselves a full a series of science there. So we just need to wait it out. Look, the shuttles are going People all the way over here to do I stuff. I'm not sure do. if that is... No, it can't be from this one. So they, they go all the way from over there. So maybe we don't need any more shuttles than that. I, I just, I don't know what the range is. Okay, looking over here, we are out of food on the Asimov. So let's send you away. Good, good, goodbye, Isaac. I uh, hope to see you again shortly. But whilst talking about that, let's go over. Let's fill the Clark up with stuff. You can see we've got mat 23 matching com uh, colonists already. So let's just go down and do some stuff. We need botanists. We need geologists. We need scientists, medics, non-specialists. Um... Let's, let's just keep going. Oh, we got an idiot. Do I... Do I... Hang about. Back, back, back. Uh, floors. Lazy. I don't want idiots. 
they cause they cause uh, malfunctions, which mean you need to go through more materials, which are it's just terrible, just terrible. Uh, geologist, scientist, medic, medic, scientist, no specialization. Geologist, special uh, scientist. I mean, we've got a lot of scientists here. I'm not sure if I need this many scientists. I don't actually have a, um, a serious amount of. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for here? A serious amount of research on the go. Research stations. So we'll have to try and do something about that. There's a lot of alcoholics in here. Now, thankfully, I do have a way of dealing with them, but that's uh, not quite what I had in mind. So that's 12. These are going to be launching down for this dome over here, which is immediately going to start causing us troubles. We, we know this. We know uh, this. These guys are not producing because their storage is full. Do I care? This is the question, though. Like, are they consuming materials whilst not working that's yeah oh yeah yeah I just watched that go up okay so in that case what we want to do is try and clear this as quick as possible uh, maybe we'll just start a concrete dump here does that sound good to you guys let's let's just do that let's get ourselves a little concrete dump if the fact that they weren't working meant that it wouldn't be using any of the maintenance uh, line then I would have just left them I would have just been like all right fair enough we'll just sit and wait and it won't be any problem uh, let's clear that out as well that should be good but as it is it's consuming resource so uh, I'm not I'm not down for that look at this I've done, I've done this in the most the most terrible way possible that that's what I'm saying Ter well, terrible is the wrong word here but it's uh it's not the most uh, efficient way I've not I've definitely not covered up stuff uh, resources low are electronics let's come over here and be like why am I short of electronics can we take on another work shift here's a question maybe maybe not the numbers are climbing so that's pretty good let's have a look we've got 23 in there 17 in there including a child you're not supposed to be here look child how do we get you out of here dome fill Filter, age group child you're not supposed to be here be gone be gone you're supposed to come over here which is what the shuttle is supposed to take care of um Hmm, do we have to put our own shuttle line down this way? Uh, it would be disappointing if we were. It wouldn't be what I was uh, hoping that we were aiming for. I was kind of hoping that these two would cover it. And that being said, what have we got going up over here? We've got 10 electronics, 12 polymers. Um, that polymer count is what we're short of. Let's have a look and see what's going on in the actual polymer factories. Do they look like they're working well? They do look like they're working well. Okay, that, that's fine. We'll, um, we'll wait up for a moment and see if we can get Clark morale in, if morale in the dome is too low renegades will appear do, do I have renegades in, in my group is, is that what's actually happened do we have renegades suddenly appearing if so I'm not going to be too happy about that let's uh how, how do we know how do we know none of these say renegades so uh, um hmm Yes. Okay, so we do have one renegade you can see in this job list here. We've got one I don't know how to figure out whether they're there or not. Do we, does it tell me here? Um, no. Renick, it's this dome. It's this dome. Sanity has got too low in this dome. How do we make it better? That is a question. That, that actually is a question right there. Let's uh, have a look and see what comfort. It says all comfort is met. Uh, morale is good. Sanity. I, I don't understand what is wrong with the little dude there. How, how do I select him? him we could quarantine down but that's that's not what i want that is not what i want i just i just want to be able to pick on that one one dude there that renegade now it doesn't look like i can even select him and i'm not going Research through complete. the 40 odd people to try and figure out what's going on there storage compression has just been done so that's cool and the clerk has arrived we're going to move him in uh over here somewhere too far from operational domes okay can't go in there uh, over by this one was that a cable fault i'm not that bothered about cable faults okay there looks like a good place and we'll get ourselves a nice little dome full of people underway hopefully we've got the fuel for this i didn't mean to quite turn my map like that but let's turn that back Sector over scan. here it's looking pretty good but New we could definitely do it with more right. things uh, more fuel being made looking at the production and demand looks Our like we're gonna have to start getting we only have a few hours to get them more oxygen. That is very troubling. How are we running out of oxygen? How is this a thing? Surely, surely we've got... Like, we, I was making six times the amount of oxygen. Let's come over here and have a look. Look at that, 12 for 1.9. And we've got lines going all the way. This has got to be a bug, right? It's got to be a bug. Look, it goes all the way in there. Ah, the dome is turned up. Low. Yeah, that, that's... that's 
that's not great. So I normally end up turning domes off and stuff when they're empty, so that we don't end up with a scenario where we're just burning through the um, the maintenance costs. But that's fine, that's fine. Okay, is, is that now all good? Um, we've got a bunch of these not working, but it's only these four, so I'm not that bothered. Colonists have arrived, that's fine. Uh, got tech underway. All right, um, I suppose I'm going to wait for 10, 15 minutes, and I'll come back for the last segment. How do we have starving? Like, honestly, how is this a thing? Ah, this is how it's a thing, because I've not actually put the building up that I meant to put up ages ago. All right, let's uh, let's get this turning over as quick as possible. Clark says he's ready to go, but I, I see that he's still full of food, so I'm not too sure on that. Uh, nursery, nursery, get out of my living space. We really, really need to get ourselves... What, a dining place down? I think a dining place would be the winner there, so let's open this up. Uh, the search for the diner. We've got a space bar and a diner. What more? What do these geologists want? I think they've got the best of every world that I could possibly offer them there. Uh, so let's turn that right up and uh, sit back and wait for a little bit. I know I said I thought this was going to be the final bit, but it um, turns out I had starving colonists to deal with. So everything in this work dome is a little bit... Oh, of course, the space bar is fully stocked with people. Classic, classic. But they look like they could definitely do with an injection of new people here. Let's have a look. He's still got 54 food. So I'm just going to order out for a new passenger rocket. We've got four, 14 matching colonists. I'm just going to take engineers, no specializations. Let's take the scientists and we'll see if we can do something with them. Geologist, geologist, scientist, no specialization. Hopefully... If we're good, let's drop one of these scientists. If we're good, we should be able to uh, move the scientists to another dome where they're a little bit more useful. Medical nerd, that's good. Which one do I want to get rid of here? I like enthusiastic guys. I like nerds. I think this guy's gonna gonna come stay behind. Okay, there we go. There we go. Now let's go find out where we got our science station. It should be around somewhere. I, I believe I put one down. This, this this is a research station, right? Okay, so what we're going to do, is we're going to filter this by specialization. We're going to go, hey, can we have all the scientists this side, please? Thanks. We'll uh, we'll go back here. Uh, then maybe even open up a second shift inside here to keep that turning over. That should be cool. Now, we should have children and scientists all working in the same place. I'm not sure about this machine parts factory. Which could definitely get shifted elsewhere um, and just have... Look, we've got we've got the machine parts factory over here, so maybe we want to do something about that. Uh, re redistribute the the people to make better use of this. I mean, we we have got the metals down here, but we've also got metals being made up there. Um, we have a power shortage. I have a power shortage. You are kidding me. How how are we out of power? I mean, I know the night has just ticked over. Look at this. Yeah, okay. Waiting for the sun to rise. What are we going to do about this? We've got a fairly strong polymer economy ticking over. So I think what I'm going to do is put down a whole bunch of sterling engines somewhere. Uh, maybe running down this way. Let's get out a little bit of power line. Always the best way to start. You start with a power cable. Watching out for that node there. I don't want to go over um, a bunch of stuff that I'm going to want to build on later and just start dropping these guys in like that. I, th I think four should be a good start. They are more than a little bit expensive, if I'm to be honest with you, but they do so much power that it is worth it. And you only need to use polymers for upkeep, which we are making literally polymers in every base. So that should work out Sector's pretty game. well for us. Mmm, it turns out I may not have put enough down. You can see that we've got our total production 267. We need 346. Wow. That is uh, 78 short. If we divide by 5, that's uh, 14. 14 either wind or solar plants we need. Or... This is just a very nice seven sterling generators, but they're so expensive, so expensive. I might just go for some solar power. Let's let's do that. I'm gonna go coming off here in a very symmetrical way. Uh, we're gonna put down a bunch of solar panels. Now I said 17, right? So uh, let's do. Oh no, let's not do it like that. Let's try and get a, a nice symmetrical look on the go. Okay, so I've done two rows of eight solar panels here. That is 16. One more than the 17 that we need. Look at that, maths. It's a, it's a thing that I can work with. Uh, hopefully, 
hopefully people are going to come along I say people hopefully our drones are going to come along and fix these up pretty quickly we've got a lot of concrete on the go why aren't these because we need we need drones that's what we actually need we actually need drones to get rid of stuff now do we want to have a food store being cable kept up reported. here cable fault has been reported uh, not so much just to keep the food but to get Clark out of here I think that's going to be something that we do it also puts the food really close to base so well, I mean if I wanted to be even closer I could have put it here right uh, another thing I want to point out is these guys here these are projector lamps when nighttime comes which is on its way we will see that this is lighting up our polymer factory over here it's uh, just a comfort thing if I remember correctly it is just a comfort thing if we go into the service and have a look at what it does here it, in fact all it does is lights up stuff you can have a look you've got service comfort written on the underside of these but no the projector light is just for fun malfunctioning pipes is good but i swore i just saw something talking about how meteors are impacting somewhere around here and that, that wouldn't be good dome has got a lack of power why why because we're still building okay I've, I've just got to wait for this to get built but in the meantime let's send clark out of here and as this disappears we can then bring asimov back with more passengers on board because you know what better time to bring in more colonists than when you're running out of power uh, it just seems like the best still Still blocking, still blocking, still blocking. I really want to put uh, Asimov here where Clark took off from. Uh, far from operational domes. I disagree, but that's probably the power problem, right? Okay, so in that case, let's come through here and up the... Man, the, the glare off of these is actually quite real. Let's uh, turn up the priority of these thankfully it's Mine's only energy. metals that they take let's take a moment you to have a look at our um, colonist overview 59 metals the power shortage is a real looks like we're gonna need even more than what I've put down but new colonists have arrived they've gone straight into this dome right tell me that tell me hyperthermia you say mmm we can do something with that no functional residence do I need to move you Oh no, is it because these are not functionally resident? Uh, Alright, well that's just going to take um, this power getting built. Oh, we've passed 100 colonists though. Look at that, 103. Hype. We have a potential issue here. It tells me that my uh, resources are low on electronics. I'm going to stop these two sterling generators here. So that, and in fact, I'm going to turn this one off, but we'll turn it back on. Once the electronics company here has got itself a... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? God and done itself a maintenance. Because the last thing I want is the electronics needed for the electronics factory not making it to the electronics factory and not being able to make more electronics. Because that that's just a horrible cyclical nightmare to get yourself stuck into. Oh, it's, it'll be horrific. Horrific. Okay, so we spent all day making these solar panels. We've managed to just push ourselves over the consumption that is going down. But uh, the morning is when the consumption is the highest. So we're going to have to try and do something about getting the rest of these built. You can see almost all of these are waiting for a few materials. But that's because almost all my drones are being held up by making these solar panels. They are the thing with the highest priority on the go right now. But I think if we have a look around, generally we're going to be making things work out quite well for us now we've got ourselves a new power system underway we managed to get ourselves a whole bunch of colonists in and ready to go they're going to be turning over metals for us getting the machine parts factories working and of course working in the space bar but i will uh, see you next time when well, we're going to try and get ourselves a new dome up and running maybe definitely try and expand this uh, power system over here is the uh, the one thing that we have fallen a little bit short of, but I will see you then when we're gonna do that. Bye!